Good afternoon, parents. My video today is about sequencing the large number cards. This activity is from ages 3 to 6 in a Montessori classroom. The direct aims are to associate the category names of units, tens, hundreds, and thousands with numeric symbols. To become more familiar with the numeric symbols of the first four categories of the decimal system. To become more familiar with the sequence of numbers up to 9,000. To further understand the laws that rule the organization of numbers in the decimal system. One of the indirect aims is to understand zero's role in the decimal system. Now, in order to do this, we have to prepare number cards. In the Montessori classroom, we use wooden number cards. But here in my house, I prepare paper cards, paper number cards. So we have to prepare one to nine, ten to ninety, color blue for the tens, color red for the hundreds, and that is one hundred to nine hundred. And for the thousands, that's from 1,000 to 9,000. And it's also color green. To begin with the activity, we lay down all the stack number cards at the bottom of the mat. We start from units 1 to 9 at the right side of the mat. Next to the units are tens. From 10 to 90 and it's color blue. On the left side of the units. Next are hundreds. 100 to 900 stack cards on the left side of the tens. And lastly, thousands from 1,000 to 9,000 stack cards on the left side of the hundreds. So we start from one to the units and put on the top right side of the map. Then ask the kids to continue to put the number cards. We'll say two units. Three units, four units, five units, six units, seven units, eight. After the kids lay down up to nine units, you can ask the kids, what is the next number after nine? And the kid will say, 10. Then you could ask the kid to pick up the tens. 10 units is one ten. 
confirm to the child that 10 units is equivalent to 110. Then you could ask the kids also, how many zeros are there in 10? And there is one. Confirm to the child that there is one. So we start 10. It will continue to put on ten. Two tens. Three tens. Four tens. Five tens. Seven tenths. Eight tenths. And nine tenths. When the child places the last tenths card, ask her or him what comes after nine tenths. And the kid will answer, 10 tenths. And you could ask the kid to point 10 tenths. And the child will get 10 tenths. And confirm to the child that 10 tenths is the same as 100. And how many zeros are there in 100? Again, it's the kid, and the kid will answer two zeros. So this is one hundred. Next, two hundred. Three hundred. Four. Five hundred six hundred seven hundred eight. And nine hundred. After placing nine hundred, you can ask the kid what is the next to nine hundred. And the kid will say ten hundred. Then confirm to the child. The ten hundred is equivalent or the same as one thousand. And how many zeros are there in a thousand? Or in thousand? There are three zeros in thousand. So this is one thousand. Three thousand four thousand five thousand. Seven thousand eight thousand nine thousand 
when the child reaches 9,000, explain that this is as high as these cards go. So we stop here in 9,000. So these are units, tens, hundred, thousand. So this is how to do sequencing the large number cards. I hope this video helps. See you next time. Bye-bye.